Austin's new fire chief has already made history, but he says he doesn't see it that way. When Chief Joel Baker was sworn in less than two weeks ago, he became the city's first African-American fire chief. KV's Kayla Norwood sat down with him tonight to talk one-on-one -on -one about his journey. And Kayla, he says he looks at his accomplishments a bit differently. Well, Chris, Chief Baker and I talked about his goals for the department and what brought him this far. And when we talked about him becoming Austin's first African-American fire chief, he gave the credit away. The journey began really uh, as a firefighter. You had to start planning to become fire chief before you become fire chief. After more than 30 years with the Atlanta Fire Department, Chief Joel Baker is now an Austinite and he's starting to settle in. In his office, he brought with him several items. Each has a unique story of its own. That's the opportunity that I had to meet two president and vice president, and of course, uh, Congressman John Lewis, who's a civil rights icon and someone I really have a lot of respect for. On this wall, it's all about firefighters, specifically black firefighters who made history, like this photo of the first three African-American firefighters in Austin who saved a life and the first 16 African-American firefighters hired in Atlanta. Now in Austin, Chief Baker is making history of his own. But as the first African-American fire chief, uh, I'm honored and humbled by that. But as I think about it, I'm really not the first in my eyes. He says those before him are the reason why he's where he is today. Although they may not have served as the fire chief, they provide opportunities for people like me and others to come out to me to serve as fire chief. This two-time fire chief wants to make a difference in the growing city of Austin and tells us he wants to start by bringing in more diversity. It's important that the Austin Fire Department, as much as we can, reflect the community in which we serve. Diversity is key for Austin Fire because you may recall in 2012, the U.S. Department of Justice started investigating whether or not the Austin Fire Department's hiring practices were discriminatory. An agreement between the city and the Department of Justice was settled by a federal judge the following year.